Now we are going to talk about the components of environment. Components means the one which makes the environment. So we can divide the components into abiotic components, biotic components and energy. Abiotic means non-living which are not alive. We can divide this abiotic components in three parts that is lithosphere, hydrosphere and atmosphere. So first is lithosphere. Lithosphere consists of the crust or the layer of the earth. The basically a place which is a place where we live. I mean the plants, the animals or organisms live. And lithosphere is a very rich source of minerals also. Hydrosphere, hydro means water. We need water to live. So hydrosphere is the water layer which is there on earth and two third part of the earth is made up of water but out of that 97 percent water is saline which means which is salted or not fit for living uh, then only three percent of the total water availability is you can say fresh water but out of that only one percent is available to the human beings to drink otherwise the rest water is in the forms of the glaciers and uh, um, snow the last being atmosphere atmosphere means it is a rich source of air and no human being or animals can survive without oxygen for even for few minutes so atmosphere is the one which has a great source of uh, gases like hydrogen oxygen helium nitrogen and others the second component of environment is biotic bio, bio means life so biotic means the one which is alive it can be plants it can be organisms it can be animals it can be living beings human beings the third is energy for anything any movement any activity we need energy whether it is a plant they need energy uh, to grow we need energy to survive for any action of human beings we need energy and there are a lot of sources of energy it can be solar energy it can be thermal energy it can be uh, geothermal energy hydro energy and all but sun is the biggest source of energy on 